and keep business afloat, especially for buyers wanting to check out homes. Ashley Matthews is in Rancho Penasquitos this morning with a look at how agents are now selling homes. And Ashley, whether it comes to our lifestyles or the way we do business, we all have to adapt in order to survive. Yeah, exactly, Marianne. And real estate agents are no different, especially because we can't even have open houses anymore. There can't be anybody inside houses or large groups inside houses. This is one that uh, real estate agents have listed here behind me. It is for sale here in Rancho Penasquitos. And normally, if you are interested, you could go online, see some pictures, maybe talk to the agent, go to an open house, schedule a showing, but that's all really not happening right now. So agents have had to make some adjustments. And we did talk to the real estate agent who has this uh, listing here. Most sellers, that don't absolutely have to sell right now are waiting, trying to wait out COVID-19. But buyers who are in the marketplace, they are still buying. Buyers can still get into the property before they sign on the dotted line. They just have to go through a few more steps, like attend a virtual open house and submit a pre-approval letter. And we know we have a serious buyer and we're trying to limit how much how the, the physical traffic through the home just based on the COVID-19 environment that we're in. Now you probably saw some video there of a virtual open house through Zoom. So that's a new option that they're using just to create a little bit of competition between potential buyers. So they still want to keep that element there. And they say it may be sticking. The Zoom open houses, even after all of this is done, when we can actually have open houses again, because it just gives buyers another option. Reporting live this morning from Rancho Penasquitos, Ashley Matthews, NBC7. Okay.